is descendant os the unique custom room is back with the new update and in this new update they've included some new things of course what's new and everything which we're going to talk about in this video so stay tuned for that let's get started let's find out the things the version which we are talking about right now in this video of course based on android 12 with the latest february security patch the latest version which is just released yesterday maybe and this looks quite good honestly it has a very good ui unique kind of things and a lot of customizations yes there are minor customizations included in this one let's take a quick look at the quick settings panel the quick settings panel if you're able to see there are some changes here this is not exactly like android 12 quick settings panel it will give you the feel of android 11 kind of quick settings panel of course not exactly the same but things are looking almost same i'm going to talk about that later on the default launcher is still the same pixel launcher is what you get pre-installed which is of course kind of good with some little bit of extra options which you get always in pixel launcher here comes the what's new app which i've shown you in the previous video of descendant OS. also they have included this app called what's new which will tell you that which are the things you get here the improvements bug fixes interference interface changes and the new features so if you want to take a look at which are the new things you get here some changes some improvements this app will tell you almost everything i found this app quite useful so yes this is also one of the good feature which you get in descendant os let's just talk about some few of the things some new changes which you get in this latest descendant os settings ui is almost same there are no minor no major changes available here there might be some minor changes and it includes a very interesting feature which i will share with you very soon things are kind of same if you move on to the volume panel quickly volume panel is almost same and this looks by the way kind of unique you don't get this kind of volume panel in any other custom room so far it includes the modern theming of course modern theming is working pretty fine the pixel launcher which you get pre-installed is not a modded one it's by default available display section includes a bit of extra customizations which i'm not going to talk about i will tell you this customization how you can unlock this new interesting menu from descendant os if you don't know about that if you know about that it's good if you want to know let me tell you how you will access that menu that is absolutely looking quite good yes it was expected that they will give you something kind of uniqueness and yes it's present let's move on to that if you move on to the accessibility settings simply scroll down at the bottom you'll see customization accessibility dashboard this looks quite good and maybe something unique i didn't got this thing in any other custom room so far if you move on to this you will see this kind of thing which includes this new menu called monitor personalization etc etc by the way features are not different it's just same but they've just implemented a new menu or kind of sub menu for you so that might look better something unique and this is what you can say in uniqueness it's not about which feature you are getting clock style which you can customize about lock screen clocks of course we have four styles available stock oxygen os sony or cupertino this looks better i think so with or without notifications to previews available here here come some quick settings customizations if you don't like this default one you can simply use the default android 12 style quick settings panel but if you like this one which they give you by default like this you can use this too this doesn't look that bad by the way but it's all about users own choice opinions and this looks better some other customizations like only notifications page if you don't want the full quick settings panel or data dashboard which i sometimes use on my device to check out how much data i've consumed so far as of course i'm a wi-fi user but still i need to know about that ambient lights which means if you have enabled the option called ambient display on your device then you can customize this to customize this too wallpapers and style of course same kind of ui lock skin customizations also has same kind of ui with a bit of some extra features or customizations for you looks quite good if you want to install this build the official website link is in the description it is available for a lot of devices including redmi note 9 pro Mi tool device redmi note 10 pro not that for for that for sorry for that but redmi note 8 will get this this update maybe tomorrow and some other devices already got this thanks for watching i'll see you in the next video goodbye over the edge feel like i'm floating through the air